Good morning, folks. It's 2225 on the ninth day, eighth month, 2022. And there she is, right on schedule, battering the coastline from Sedona all the way over through to Adelaide. Watch this. This is not going to be a pretty sight. If you live along this coastline, watch what they're coming in. And I told you it was coming. You've had plenty of time to prepare, so get your cards out. You've been impacted as of right about now. Right about there is when this, even though this is that far offshore, uh, because it's moving in this direction, these winds are going to batter this coast from Seduna through to Adelaide. Um, uh, the time to get off of your land is, is over. Uh, you didn't heed certain warnings. They don't think certain things are real. That's okay. They can kill you anyhow. And we got the double, right? The double dutch. We've been seeing this a lot. And coming about here in the midday. Here in about what? About. Oh, that's not far away, is it, here, folks? All right, here's your rain and thunder. And I'm going to go right into it. And these winds are very, very heavy. I'm going to turn them off for a moment. So you can kind of get a look at the impacted areas and there's going to be a lot of it all the way along the shore you're going to be heavy 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 surf when this comes ashore it's going to be some very damaging uh, winds you can expect a lot of frequent lightning from here to here and uh, the coast is going to get battered uh, some of these areas here will experience flooding I'm not even familiar with the tides of what the tables are but you are going to be impacted by this today um, your winds that you can expect of accumulation forces are very, very fucking high. Oh, part coming in land. <laughs> I was trying to go clean today, but that didn't happen. But I'm, I'm upset. Um, this is a, a tropical cyclone. Okay, anything above 63, you're there. You got it going on. Um, have they told you you were going to get hit with a tropical cyclone? Well, I told you. I even called it that. Here it is. It's in its tropical storm strength now, isn't it? Um, let's double check. What's the wind speed scale for so storms? Do, 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 do. What is this? 63 violent storm. Now we want this, uh, usually the Beaufort scale is in. And, 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 and there we go. And we got it in kilometers an hour. They're saying 74, it's the strong gale, strong game, violent storms. Right, we need the one for cyclones. It's a very, I'm telling you, it's a very dangerous storm. I seen the setup coming about a week ago. Uh, the, the scale that rates uh, cyclones by wind. TARDIS, why did that come up? Why the heck did that? I must got TARDIS on my mind. If we could turn back time, would you do it? Yeah, well, we'll just accept them all. Bzzz, getting fried from space. What was that all about? Here we go. Right, uh, miles per hour. Why are they telling me a miles an hour? We, we, give me the cyclones. This is not being very helpful. <laughs> I had it up the other day. Now we'll get rid of that. The scale they raised cyclones by one. Well, let's get rid of that part. Okay. Do, 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 do. Measuring. Yeah, I bet if I go to images, it just comes up. There we go. All sorts of stuff out here, isn't it? How many knots you got? A mile per hour. Why is it all a mile per hour? Everybody, I'm wanting to. Right, I got a better way. All right, you tell me the knots. Tropical depression, hurricane storm, 36 knots, da 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 uh. <laughs> You're recording it out there. Oh, they got one in Africa. Would you look at the kilt? They ain't recording yours. They are not. Now they're now I'm gonna bust your balls. You want should I bust your balls? Let's. Alright, I want my scale in knots. 
and I can do the not scale. This is just exciting. Australia, boy, are you guys going to have a day. So let's do this in knots. Right, 49 knots. That's, that's quite a few knots. Right, 41 there. And what are they getting actually on land? This side should have the worst when this wind comes around. It's going to hem it right here. It's just going to be flooding. It's going to be up in here. It's going to be along this coast here, and this place here is still in high danger, like I said the other day, Port Lincoln, and this, or whatever this one is. This town here, Coffin Bay, you, you still on my list saying, eh. if you didn't leave by now, fail. That's a strong fucking storm. What they got out of sea? Now I'm doing you a tour. I gotta see something. Well, I want that back in kilometers. Right. Boy, you guys got a big one. I'm gonna go 12 hours backwards and let's have a look. This is your infrared of the storm coming in that's impacting you. And I'm pretty much just gonna cover this storm today. Bombias that are going on over here you'll see in all sorts of, of nasties I've got that already loaded look how the boil of this storm keeps pushing back up that's a big rotation coming towards you Melbourne watch out with like I said when this thing dissipates apart it's gonna be bad that's a hell of a forced rotation it's a high you see how it's uh, counterclockwise there right here let me see if I can get it Right in here. It's not letting me jump. I got a bit of a clockwise swirl. That's telling me that uh, Adelaide's radar is beaming. Should be here. And good evening, everybody. I hope you uh, knuckled down and uh, enjoyed the show tonight. Because I'm not in a rush. See it at the end, see the curve? Boom. That's a bust. You ain't hiding it. Oh, look at that beam coming out here, huh? Hey, yeah, big V-shaped thing pointing right at the radar station, huh? Nothing to see here, folks. No geoengineering going on. No chem foolery canes to go around. What a bunch of numbnuts doing this to us. Are you guys having a good day? I don't think so. Not with this, this approaching storm. You guys got to batten down the hatches. This is going to be one to remember. Another one of those one in a hundred year storms coming in the same year again all the time. All the time. But you don't see that beam there till you come in. Right? They made that such a bunch of gibberish. And there it is. Bzzz, getting fried, getting fried. And here's the beam out that side. All of this nexus point is right here dude, where the radar is. Right in the center of my screen is the guilt that's uh, beaming. Yep. I thought so. You could see the signature of it in the clouds. You ain't, ain't hiding this. Because I could look here and see what was going on. The flow is wrong. They had suddenly it heated up. When it heats up in this hemisphere, it turns wildly like that, don't it? I'm actually got quite a concern about the backcountry here. Bendingo. Somebody bending the dingo. Oh my. You know I'm seeing something, don't you? Right here. Look at the rotational heating right there. That's going to create a convection. It's going to fuck Horsham. When it when it hem come, Yeah, that's bad. You guys, uh, this is going to go well inland. What are they showing on... Uh... Oh yeah, it's a big swath. I'm just going to do a sus in here. Got to sus something. Yeah, the big tendril's still hanging around. So, yeah, that moisture's definitely all up through here. We got any new snow other than the mountains? 
Not really. So it'll be slushy. And if it melts all that stuff up here and it, and it comes down towards Sydney, you guys are fucked. Your storm, your flood will come from behind. And I do worry about that, actually. You got a lot of snow up in the mountains. And uh, it's getting warmer. What's your night times? That's day. Yeah, it's warm enough to melt. If you guys get a significant amount of rain, that could happen, actually. All through here where I've seen this big line of chem. Yeah, look at that, huh? Right through. Hmm. You know I'm not liking something. Yeah, they're setting you up bad. This is an odd place to have all that much moisture work itself in, but it just happens to be over a lake. Bottle water much? Need new hydroelectric dam? Switch into a different kind of power? I think that moisture is going to go a bit up toward Wagga Wagga off of your ass and yes. Yes. Oh my god, my new second favorite name. They're gunning for yes. The geoengineers are gunning for yes. And there's the creature from the Black Lagoon. I mean, Canberra. The mighty straight line. Somebody got pissed off when they said, Fuck this, man. I'm having that. Hey! But that's the government, man. The government can't because cause you let them, man. They scammed you guys so bad this year. Thumbarumba, thumbarumba, sesibo, ya. <laughs> Whatever that is. Kumba. You got the coolest names. Mm, they're going to get rid of the name on that place after they get rid of all the cows. Sorry, you can't have that. That's the names offending me. Tankerton. You guys got some cool names. Rosebud. That's the name of the sled, isn't it? Uh-huh. Somebody, I went there. Yeah, I went there. The Rubicon. Hmm. Not looking too good, folks. Not looking too good at all. I'm not happy with it. Let's see what your radar is showing me. Again, I want a different radar. Um, Which one is it going to let me have? Show lighting. Lightning. Yeah, let's see the lightning. That ought to be dramatic. Doink. Sound? Well, we can get sound now. I'm going to pass on that. Right, let's see if we lighten it up. And they're saying it's only rained in here. <clears throat> There's just a big mass of crap and chem shit going over the top of fucking the rest of the country. Little rotation in here and a rotation out. She's bringing in the cold. Maybe the lightning kicking off here offshore. Now, not as much as I'm expecting. How about the uh, shower say sustained over the lake? Where often bottled water happens. I've been watching a pattern, and I'm a bit of a conspiracy theory, or what a theorist, or my, let's say I'm a critical thinker who likes to put connections together about conspiracies of cover-ups of real reality of what's going on. The reality is you got a man made a cane going on, and this is uh, just off the coast of Ireland today. Did they deserve that? Oh, my fucking God. These, would you look at the guilt here? Chemtrail, chemtrail, chem bomb, chem bomb, hacking, coughing, Here's the march of the of the sickness mix coming across. It's like farts. They killed Kenny, you fucking bastards. And there ain't a limerick in the world that I want to come up with that's going to fix this. There once was a pilot named Joe who sprayed the skies, and I think that blows. How the fuck does he sleep at night while I'm banging his wife? Yeah, I went there. Mm-hmm. And off my hand to his face, I do throw. Well, look how square that shit is. You gonna tell me that's natural weather over Australia here on the August 9th image? Look at the toxicity of this shit. Look at this creeping death. The big square of crap over the top of a country that's being cunted 
by the contocrats in charge. You're fucking your whole goddamn world up. Look at this shit. Look like a great big old dick. That's the nudge move. I keep showing you in the southern oceans. That's the nudge. And well, who's got the fudge and who's got the nudger? You want to be the nudgy anymore? Because you're getting fucked this week. And from here to here, you guys are going to see the finger of God come down on your coastline. You got a house along this coastline? Go take a picture of it now. It's going to be a floaty later on. What a fucking shame. They can't buy you out. They burn you out. They flood you out. They want you out. Go read the Agenda 2030. Sustainable cities. You will own nothing and be happy. Because the computer bought it off. Yep, Aladdin won. Black Rocks, Aladdin. Go look. Go look. You guys got homework to do. Look at the EMF here on your west coast. Bzzz, getting fried, getting fried. Xmas style. Bend over, they'll drive. I'm in a mood tonight. I am so tired of chemtrails and crap. I saw this one storm off the coast of America today. Look at the shape of this. It looks like freaking Catula. Yeah, the eyes and everything. You tell me that's a natural storm there creeping along? I say, you're out of your mind. You ask me what my credentials are, I'll say, who the fuck are you to ask that? If you can't open your eyes and see this, where are your credentials to even look at anything? Do you have a credential to interpret a magazine? People ask me for my freaking credentials. What the fuck is wrong with them? You don't know what a chem bomb is by now? Then you're part of the cover-up that is the conspiracy that we theorize about existing. It ain't a theory to read you a UN document, okay? It's a it's a conspiracy that you that you are programmed to not even accept information that comes from the United Nations. Like, oops, we put that out. Oops, we got a man made a cane coming across again. Going to fuck Guatemala and them as it goes over. You got a big one being brewed off the coast of New Orleans, and I know they're making one for here. Look, you got a big one coming. Yep, they're making it now. Yep, see the hurricane season is blowing up a storm out here in the Gulf of Mexico. Look at this crap. Look at the squares in it. What the hell, they forget to edit out the feed there. Hmm. Happiness ain't no warm gun. You know what happiness is? The truth. Honest. Whatever it is, whoever did it, we worry about blame later. We just need the truth. And then we go for the solutions. And then, well... Make your rope, because somebody's going to be deserving, and justice should do, be visible. This big old fucking crap over Canada, that's a big mass of shit. Still have a lot of ice out here. Like that. That might be ice. Mm-hmm. Come on, think natural first. If you ain't thinking natural, you, you've just totally went full megatard and forgot critical thinking. It's an interesting vortex. It's very common in these islands. That's an interesting one. If you ever watch the vortices that come off the Cape Verde or the Canary Islands, they very often uh, do that pattern. Mm -hmm. So don't tell me, oh my God, when you see that. It's, it's kind of natural. But that's not Portugal, Lisbon. Are they Lisbians? I don't know. <laughs> Lisbonians? It's one or the other, isn't it? Yeah, Lisbians. I'll go with that one. Just a bit squared off there, isn't it? Bzzz, getting fried, getting fried. Portuguese style. I fucking caramba. Undelay, undelay, yee-haw, yee-haw. Fucking Christ, what the hell is this off the coast of Tunisia? Kimbom, Kimbom, chocolate Malta. Big bunch of crap over there. So you very, that could be volcanic gas from Stromboli. Yeah, Stromboli's there. There's volcano been kicking off here a bit too. Bunch of sand coming across the med. Chem bomb holding it in the air. See the color of it holding all that sand? Yep. 
And uh, for all you folks, uh, this is denial, okay? So this is the only place that you could go and be in denial about geoengineering, okay? And even then, you got to look up over, uh, over these names. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my. That's denial, by the way. And they always argue of where's the source of denial. I think oneness is the source of denial. God did it. And quit arguing. Look at the chem and shit over here, over India. Boom, boom, boom went the plumes over here. Oh my God, look at this shit. Oh, you want to see some plumes? You're feeling left out. And somebody said, yeah, you finally said it. Yeah, I've been watching. Of course I have. I'm just not getting very clear imagery. I mean, this is what your BOM is giving me to deal with. No shit. Didn't really see much there, can we? So I'm not happy with that this morning. So I wasn't showing it. This one nudge and this one. Watch. Nudge. 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 And you're getting fudged. And around they go. And you got a camp bomb here going in two directions, right? Hello. Boom, boom. Let's, which way should we go in the wind? I'll just come this way. I'll go south. You go north. The impossible storm. I mean, how many rotations you got? A low, a low, a low, a low. Hello, how are you? It's a bunch of shit. It is. It's the shit show. It is streaming right over the biggest shit dump of them all. Canberra. Can you bear to smell of the fucking place when they open their mouths and spew bullshit? It means like Pelosi. She'll knock it down with the alcohol smell. She's probably not even allowed in Muslim countries because you can never purge the alcohol out of her body enough to walk around. And if she took off her fucking clothes, that would definitely be a crime regardless of what country you're in. Jesus Christ, you want to talk about a walking bag of bones doing whatever the fuck she's told? If that girl ain't drinking lizard juice every fucking day, could you see it? It scratches her head with her tail when she gets up in the morning. Ugh, snap, snap, go to choppers. How much flows you got going here? Damn, that's fucked. They're bringing all that in and around into this big square. Having a square dance. These, these, the day of your round storms are gone. It's winter time. You should not be having a storm like this. You should not be having this tropical blast coming down, bringing the, the remnants of all, all the, the monsoon storms from here in, into a chem soon over here. My forecast from yesterday is still accurate. I wanted to show you an update as it came over this morning. So I'm going to continue with that. Right, there she is. Brought it home, folks. That's a very slow-moving storm. So the damage is going to be... Uh, cat is fucking traffic along these coastlines. I, I feel very bad for you folks. Some of the rains and the winds as this thing comes ashore inland here is going to be very damaging to properties that are already at their... Stress limits. Right? All the way the swast through here over the next three days is what's really going to matter is the same. So after that, or really, you get a break because nothing changed. Oh! If something changed. Oh, then this walks out here and that goes over. So all that's going to have come over. And then when it gets out here, it's going to trigger and fall. And none of it going to get Zealand. Oh! Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's how the hell they were going to get away with that. Fiji, look like you may have negotiated with the GO people. Did not get fucked, but I think my forecast is still accurate with you. All the all the pressures are still the same. Yeah, they we're getting honest. I mean, we're talking there's a meter of rain falling out here. But that could very easily go that direction. For me to see Fiji get uh, 35 to half a meter of rain fairly quickly on, in that period that I said is still uh, within the realms of more than possible. Look at this over the lakes. I'm telling you, the Nestle's ordering fucking weather. Yep. And who's paying for it? You are. You're paying for lack of work. You're paying for it with frustration. You're paying for it with stress. You're paying for it because they write blank checks in your name. Don't they? Who is they? If you ever asked me that question in person, I'd say, who the hell are you? Not know who they are. Where have you been your whole life? It's a giant club, and the only person that asks that question is one of the people in it. At any time, any of these large tendrils will be ashore. I'm not believing this, and this is right over the city center. 
right, you guys are getting a flood. It's going to be small, quick, and a deluge because all this is running this way, especially through here. My God, you poor folks. It's going to ruin that wine. You'll be whining about wine over there in the Roxby Downs. Now, that's a gem country, isn't it? And over here is wine. I'll tell you another good place for wines over here. Right around here. Wine. Seddon. Oh, my. I don't think I can look at this much more. It's, it's, it's just painful. But I will suffer through. Why am I on the 8th? Goink. Oh, yeah, we already looked at the big dick nudging, y'all. Oh, we got a big something going on up here. That's a nudge. Boom. You got a radar on, don't you? Dun, dun. All right, I'm going to get away from the sat viewer. Go and put on National Loop. Townsville. We see it blasting on the big one. Radar help. Yeah, but it's showing up in scatters there. That's the reef. They're blasting it. A bunch of bastard blasters. You bastard blasters. Where's Master Blaster controlling Barter Town? Right? Fucking hell. Well, it's time for all of us to be the raggedy man. Look at that shit right there. Bzzz. Oh, we can catch that. We can catch him with your pants down here. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Getting fried, getting fried. See it? How long has it been going on? What's going on? Look at that, it's frying. Pinning that moisture. Controlling where it goes. But the official excuse is it's a glitch. A glitch doesn't happen every day. You see my point there? It's a glitch. Mm-hmm. Every day. All the time. Sure. Would, would you like a booster with that? It's a booster glitch. Bzzz, bzzz, getting fried. We got going on Warburton here. Definitely some beam in there. You know, oh, all these other ones just happen to be shut down. There's nothing going on in Calgary at all. You know, nothing, nothing to see over here. Every one of these is blasting, absolutely blasting away. You can see it. Blasted bastard. Yep. So anyways, I will now go back to Wendy and I'm going to just roll your forecast for a minute. <sighs> see if I can catch my winds here. So all right, let's uh, zoom back and then watch you uh, see the weather plan unfold. Here it comes ashore. Bzz. A lot of lightning, crack, pow, a little ball of whitening in the wall of thunder. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm having a drink. Yeah, this is going to just hover around. Just going to hang there. Hang fire. Yeah, when it comes in here, I stay here. That's when it's really formed up. It's not going anywhere quick. So it looks like once the low gets to about here, it's going to kick everything off. And I'll be out of town on Friday, but I think I'll bring my laptop just for y'all. You got on the weather event, I think I'd like to cover it for y'all. Whoa, what the hell was that all about? Melted bricks, man. My God, yeah, that's a bad storm. 
Oh, man. You see where this is going? Just where I said it was last week. Like, when I give you an eight-day warning about geoengineering events and they're there, come on. Where, at what point hasn't your weather service just failed you? On this day here, you guys are going to get hammered. And that's a dangerous storm. Batten down the hatches, get a mattress for the top of your car. Because it's going to be a hell of a day. Look what's going on on this coast. I ain't forgot about you, Perth and them. That's a big lightning coming through. It's going to take about, looks like four hours for that to cross the coast. This one here is an all-day event. See it? A lot of flaring ups. That's when it's at its most dangerous. The electrical potential going through this thing is, like I said before, is it's ducting. It's like a wire. And this, this whole country's lit up like a candle. They got so much shit sprayed over the top of you here coming your way. It's already over to here. I showed it earlier. If you find my forecast valuable and you'd like to support my work, thank you. Uh, you can do so at P-A-Y-P-A-L forward slash Robert Deutsch. Or go look on my wall. Rod and Rachel of Sacred Knowledge Energy Tool made some of, of the like the pendant that you see me wear all the time with the green on it. They made, uh, I think there's only three of them left. So you'd have to specify green. So they're on my wall. And some of the proceeds of that will go to, uh, of these go to help me as well. And any that are ordered over that, but they'll see that there might be a market for the ones like mine. The Roush edition. <laughs> I was joking with Rod about that earlier. Anyways, big love, and I'm, I'm hoping if Rod's got some time, I'll go and do one more live tonight and let you guys ask him some questions. So, um, bad down the hatches. Something wicked your way comes. And when we see stuff, what do we do? We warn. We warn. And, well, I'm warning you. Warning, warning, danger, 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 Adelaide. Here it comes, batting down the hatches. Get ready. It's here. Something wicked. Your way comes. It's a chem foon. What you gonna do? Big love, peace. <laughs>